This is Code.org. I'm currently working on their CS Principles course. I'm on Unit 5, Building an App, Lesson 1, Buttons and Events, Puzzle 22. Add an image and make, and make a chaser game. Awesome. Now you try. Add an image to your app and modify the code so that the image jumps around the screen rather than a button. Your little game should have text on top of the screen with the title or, or instructions for what to do. An image that runs away moves randomly based on some mouse event. Tip. Hint. The easy way to do this is simply change the ID of on event and set position to respond to an image instead of button. Remove the button from the app after, Im after the image is working. We won't need it anymore. Change the label text so that the instructions make sense for your game. The game is even more fun if you use mouse over. I was thinking that. Uh, make the background interesting, optional extensions, make the background interesting, add another image that runs away, see what happens with the command hide element show element, have two UI elements, user interface elements, where interaction with one controls or does something to the other, finalize your chaser game, note, we'll revisit this game in the next le lesson where we can improve it, this is just version one, alrighty, so, lots of stuff, let's add an image, to do that, you go to design, I'm going to grab my image and drop, okay, and then I'm going to click choose, and you can upload or select one of their icons, okay, so for ease sake, I'm probably going to pick an icon, but I want a cool, I want the rocket, oh, neat, and I can change an icon and color, um, nah, let's go. Maybe green, or not, or that. Sure, that's my rocket, okay? And then, this is my quote-unquote image. Now, what is the ID of this? I'm going to actually call this image. I'm going to say rocket, because, well, it's an image of a rocket, okay? So then I'm going to go back over here and do move button nope rocket that's the position i want to set run hmm why isn't it working because you need to change both of these right watch what happens here <laughs> so i definitely need to change this as well and run and here's the problem with the size changing i need to get rid of that now unless I want my button, unless I want my rocket to randomly change, which I don't, right? So I just need X, Y for their position. Run. Ah, there it goes. Okay, so that means I can go back to design. I can click on this. Oh, I can delete it here. Great. Uh, try to catch the rocket. And then I go back over to my code. And I do like the idea of doing mouse over. Right. <laughs> That's fun. Um, and I actually like it that it can go over my text. What were some of their make a, the background more interesting? Ooh. Challenge accepted. I don't know what that does yet, though, do we? Okay, background. Ooh. I'm going to make our directions disappear, maybe, if we go over them. So, there, I'll add that. On event. And I could, should make a better title for that. And we'll hide them. Run. Boop. And now we're not going to see those again unless we reset it. <laughs> cool. Um, awesome. And we will keep building on this. So, great. 
I'm going to go ahead and hit finish and let's keep going.